Hey there everybody, Phil here for AndroidCentral.com. It's time to take a look at an app that's been around for a long time, actually. It's gotten millions of downloads, and it's name you know. It's just not an app that I've used a whole lot. It's Opera Max, and it actually can help you save a whole lot on your data when it matters most. So let's go take a quick look at Opera Max for Android. Okay, so here's the gist of Opera Max. Now, whereas you're probably used to Opera as a browser, here's a VPN or a virtual private network for those of you who haven't enjoyed such things before. That means that all the network traffic coming in your phone goes through Opera servers first, and there's a good reason for that. Opera Max takes all those cat pictures and cat videos and cat GIFs and compresses them just before they get to your phone or tablet, making them smaller in size. And that means you'll be using less data. So one question is why you'd want to do that in the first place. And the short answer is, well, to save on your data usage. Now, a lot of folks out there don't enjoy unlimited plans or have gigabyte after gigabyte to burn through. And if you're traveling overseas and on a short-term limited plan, this is definitely worth exploring. Now, the other question is, well, how it works. Now, the compromise of compression is quality and speed, or occasionally apps might not work quite the same way. Generally, I've had a pretty good experience with Opera Max. Sometimes things look a little wonky and pictures might have a tiny bit of artifact but I'm willing to bet you can't tell unless you're side by side. And the cool thing here is that you really have discrete controls over what Opera Max is controlling and when it's controlling it. If you don't care about compressing data when you're on Wi-Fi, just turn that part off. Same goes for when you're on mobile data and you don't want Opera Max to work ever on a specific app. All you have to do is turn that off too individually. So you can be as picky as you want about the things you want. And Opera Max does a nice job showing the data detail on every app you use so you know how much data you're using and how much you're saving. And if you're worried about routing all your data through Opera, there are a couple things to know. First is that the very first thing you see when you launch Opera Max for the first time is links to the privacy policy in terms of service. Read them. The second is that encrypted data is immune to Opera Max for the obvious reason. It's encrypted. So while Opera Max isn't necessarily an app that I'm going to be using every day, it's definitely one to consider on days when your data usage really matters.